Hello friends, in this video we are going to be discuss about what is the solution I applied for this problem, what exactly I am facing. So when I developed the script using rest assured, I observed postman gives right response but when I used rest assured returns wrong response. How I can define this problem in different way? The first one is postman gives right response but treasure should returns wrong response or else receiving a bad request error when using rest assured but works fine with postman. The third term getting HTTP status 400 bad request in post request in rest assured. So this is the way I can get it through internet when I am searching my problem. Okay. So after that I assume exactly what is the problem defined here. It was mismatching the response. How I can resolve this one. So if you see here postman response. So after hitting this URL I am getting success true and session ID I am getting right. What is the status code 200 ok. So when I develop the script using rest assured that time after executing this code I am getting status code is 200 fine but when coming to the response body I am getting the different format. Here in this code I am handling get method, post method and delete method. Anyhow it will be fetching the previous one not this uh, post uh, response ok. So first when I googling this error First I encountered one uh, solution through stack overflow. If I open this link, okay, so have observed this is the code I have seen. I implemented the same code structure for my problem. But here problem is after using pretty print I am getting the whole response body. So what is the request parameter, what is the uh, URI you are using, what is the body. In this response body I could not able to fetch the specific value. I tried multiple way. If you want to fetch the value from the pretty print format you need to convert uh, uh, JSON format using Jackson. So this is a, some different way we have to follow. So it is taking some time. So that reason I am jumping to the solution 2. This solution 2 only I find by myself what I observed. So here you can store this base URI using restreshow.base URI. Then what is the post request you are going to be passed in your request body. I am passing a request token which is I am fetching from the previous get request. Okay, so that reason I am passing directly that string variable. After that rest assured dot given content type I am passing as here JSON format. The next inside body I am passing this post request token here. Next I am going to be update the post request URL. This is the base URL. This is the post request URL. Okay. So here after executing this code I am getting the perfect matching of postman response body in rest assured. Okay. So if you see this is the success under session id which is I am written in postman response the same you have seen here success to session id because I want to get the session id I have to pass into next uh, uh, request which is I am going to be delete this session id. I am going to be fetch this session id from post then I am going to be pass into the delete session. So in that case I find uh, this is the better solution. Finally the postman and rest assured response is matching ok. So this is the my blog site I will update you uh, in my video description. You just open and uh, you can go through here ok. I hope this video will help you ok. Thank you guys.